Spindle Kids, it is time to draw. Don't worry, Billy. Everything's under control. You love building robots, and today we're drawing everyone's favorite, Baby Bot. Grab your paper and pencil, and let's get started. First, we'll start with Baby Bot's head and body. Draw a half circle that looks like an upside down U, like this. Then draw a straight line connecting the beginning and the end of the half circle. Well done. That's Baby Bot's head and body. Let's continue building. I mean, drawing Baby Bot's face. For Baby Bot's eyes, start with two half circles for the eyebrows and then draw a circle for the pupil. Exactly like that. For his mouth, make sure to give Baby Bot a big smile. See how the mouth looks like a sideways letter D? Great. Now Baby Bot can talk. For Baby Bot's body, draw a line that goes all the way across through his mouth. Like that, Lingo Kids. Baby Bot loves to grab apple pies, and for that, he needs his arms. To draw the arms, make a circle for the shoulder where the head and the body meet on each side. Next, draw two lines on each side, stretching out from his shoulder. At the end of these lines, make another circle for the hand. And don't forget to draw his fingers. One, two, three, four. Four fingers on each side. Great work. Since Baby Bot is a robot, he can stretch his arms super far, which makes him a great dancer. Let's draw some lines on each arm to show that they can stretch in and out. Try to make them the same distance apart. Amazing! To dance, Baby Bot also needs his legs. But first, we need to draw a thin, long rectangle as a connecting piece right under his body. This will be where his legs connect to his body. Well done! Get ready, Lingo Kids! Baby Bot's legs are made out of different pieces and we need your help assembling all the parts. Let's start with the leg on the left side. Make a rectangle going down from the body with slightly rounded corners. Draw an eggplant for the foot and then connect the eggplant to the rectangle with a squiggly line. Now, the other leg is longer than the first. Once you've drawn the second rectangle, Draw the top of a plunger for his foot and then draw four diamonds to connect his foot to the rectangle. Excellent. Baby Bot is stylish and loves to wear a hat, which goes up and down as Baby Bot walks. Let's draw it to the left above Baby Bot's head. Draw a rectangle for the bottom of the hat and then a square on top. Don't forget the stripes. Finally, it's time to decorate Baby Bot's suit. Since Baby Bot is a robot, he has lots of buttons. Start by drawing two circles on his body on the left and then one circle underneath. Even though Baby Bot is a robot, he is so friendly and has a big heart. Draw his two cheeks to show how big his smile is and his heart on the right. Excellent. There's just one more button to draw on his leg. Well done. Get your crayons ready, Lingo Kids, because it's time to color. For the colors, we will use dark blue, red orange, yellow, turquoise, purple, red, gray, and black. First, use your red-orange crayon to color Baby Bot's head. Next, use the yellow crayon to color just one of Baby Bot's cheeks and the body. Great! 
use the turquoise crayon to color the piece that connects Baby Bot's body to the legs. Use the red crayon to color the stripes on the left leg and the foot on the right. Use the dark blue crayon to color the hat, the fingers, the leg on the right, and two of the buttons. Use the pink crayon to color the rest of the buttons, the other cheek, and Baby Bot's heart. Use the purple to color the foot on the left. Use the black crayon to finish Baby Bot's eyes, mouth, hands, arms, shoulders, and parts of the legs and feet. Finally, use the gray crayon to color in between the black lines on Baby Bot's arms. Amazing! Thanks for watching and drawing along with us. Parents, your child did great. We'd love it if you'd share their artwork with us on social media for a chance to be featured on our channels. There's nothing better than seeing the art made by our Lingo families around the world. Just tag us. See you next time. Subscribe to our YouTube channel now so that you don't miss a beat. And for more play learning fun, head over to the Lingo Kids app.